Will this little microphone destroy your YouTube channel or make it better than ever? Let's find out right now. When people are watching videos, they never want to watch a video that sounds like this. Hi guys, today in this video, we're going to spend one and a half hours talking about how you... Mm, that sounds great. Instead, they want good quality sound and you need to use an external microphone in order to do that. But, can you get a microphone that's less than $150 and still sound professional in a size this? Tiny? Well, we're going to test this microphone. It's called the Movo WMX2, and we're going to head outside and give it the test right now. Okay, so we are outside in the hot sun right now. We're going to test out the WMX2. I've got it connected here as the lavalier microphone, and uh, I'm standing probably about uh, eight feet away at this point in time, maybe 10 feet, eight feet probably about, right? And I'm going to walk back. Supposedly, this one will do about 300 feet. Not sure I can go that far away, but we're going to go to a manageable distance and see how it sounds. So here we go. I'm going to back up here. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. So I'm at the edge of the curb here. I took 32 steps, probably about yeah, maybe like 50 feet or so, and uh, hopefully it still sounds good. I'm going to go even further. So I'm going to turn around and head this way. Now I'm going to have my back to the camera here at this distance. Hopefully you can still hear me with my back to it. Yeah, sure. That sounds great. I'm going to keep on walking over here. And we're gonna walk up to where this truck is here. And so now we're quite a distance away. I can barely see the, uh, the camera all the way down there. So hopefully this still sounds good. Hopefully you can even see me out here. But that sounds great. But uh, again, I, I don't know how many feet this is. This has gotta be, uh, you know, probably close to 80 feet or so. Um, hopefully it sounds good. Now I'm gonna test one other thing here because one of the things about this microphone is that you have the uh, built-in microphone, which I know you can't see me showing as you hear, but uh, there is actually a microphone built into the transmitter so that you don't even have to have a lavalier. So theoretically, I pull out this lavalier microphone and my input should now be with this microphone here. So I'm gonna test this. Uh, testing one, two, three, four, five, six. This is the microphone on top of the WMX2 without the lavalier plugged in. You can see the lavalier does not make any noise, but this does. So there we go, we're gonna test that out and see. So hopefully it still sounds clear. Hopefully you're getting a nice clear signal. We'll see how it sounds when we get back to the studio. All right, we'll see you guys inside. Well, what did you think? Did this little tiny microphone stand up to the test? I personally think it did. I was able to walk all the way across that parking lot, even have my back to the camera and still got great sound. And of course, in videos, that's what we want. We want good, clear sound. And this little tiny microphone at only $150 will give you exactly that. And the package that I got with this actually has two transmitters. So you could have two lavalier microphones on two different people, record them at the same time, whether you're using your smartphone, a DSLR, or a traditional camera, you can get great sound with multiple guests for less than $150. That is a magnificent deal and one that you need to check out right now. Go and click the link down below this video so you can pick this up right away. You are not going to get better sound in a tiny little microphone like this than the Movo WMX2. So check it out and we'll see you in the next video.